six would be what is a Negro? And the answer, a Negro, a name given to a river in West Africa by Moors because it contains black water. 87, what is meant by the word black? Black, according to science, means death. 88, what does the word colored mean? Colored means anything that has been painted, stained, varnished, or dyed. 89, what does Ethiopia mean? Ethiopia means something divided. 90, can a man be a Negro, black, colored, or Ethiopian? No. So, you know, here it is in plain English in the one-on-ones. Our illustrious prophet Noble Jalee said, you can't be Negro, black, or colored. Oh. Colored, anything that's painted, varnished, or dyed. All right, and they talk about, and then again, they say a Negro gave it, gave it to a river in West Africa by the Moors because it, it contains black water. So he's showing you all that science, right? And again, when you're dealing with political science, social science, you're dealing with status, you can't, your nationality is not an adjective, all right? You're not civil mortuus, all right? All nations, all people have to proclaim their nationality. All right, that's, that's the key. Now, with that, I showed you in 1740, the Negro Act, South Carolina. Eric Eggers Bay mentioned the Christian Black Slave Codes. All of those laws, all of those codified laws, all are in conjunction with one another, all right, to have us as property. Now, with the, the now you have... Again, the Sunji Free Moors Act. If you don't have this, y'all should, should download it. Have this, you know, with your paperwork. This is a, definitely a case that you want to reference. Moors Sunji Act of 1790. Exactly. This is a major right here. This, this right here shuts down a lot of arguments. The Moors Sunji Act of 1790 is a name given in the 20th and 21st century, 1790 advisory resolution passed by South Carolina House of Representatives clarifying, clarifying the status of free subjects of the Sultan of Morocco, Mohammed bin Abdullah. The resolution offered the opinion that free citizens of Morocco were not subject to laws governing blacks and slaves. Petition from Sunji Free Moors. On January 20th, 1790, a petition was presented to the South Carolina House of Representatives from a group of four individuals who were subjects to the Moroccan emperor and residents of the state. They desired, if they happened to commit any fault amenable to be brought to justice, that as subjects to a prince allied with the United States through the Moroccan-American Treaty of Friendship, they would be tried as citizens instead of the Negro Act of 1740. See, they knew they, they, they was doing their research. They knew their they information, their history. Wow. The Free Moors, Francis, Daniel, Hammond, and Samuel petitioned petition on behalf of themselves and their wives, Fatima, Flora, Sarah, Clarinda. They explained how some years ago while fighting in defense of their country, they, had, they and their wives were captured and made prisoners of war. Remember I said kidnapping? Now we're talking about POWs. It's the difference between being kidnapped or being a POW, prisoner of war, versus a Negro slave. Pr but prisoners of war by an African king. Remember, Amistad case, they were prisoners of war by other Africans. Europeans didn't even reach, Af reach Africa like that. Contrary to what Root shows you, Amistad gave you more of the truth. They was enslaved by other Africans, then sold to so-called Europeans who themselves were mixed bloods. Exactly, exactly. Their status was separated from a Negro. Might look the same. Garb-wise, I may have on a turban of Fez, Jalabaya. He got on rags, but we still got the same skin hue. 
I have status, I know I'm a more. He's brainwashed condition that he's a Negro, he's black, he's colored. Property. Yeah, this is this is 1790. Exactly. Oh. Exactly. If this is 1790 now, with our paper trail, how we conduct ourselves, our garb, our titles of Ellen Bay, so on and so forth, we wouldn't be subjugated. So this is why this had to be pushed, because with all the technology, information, age we have now, right? Back then, they being recognized. Now, it shouldn't be no problem. It shouldn't be no problem in today's day and age. 